Kinoda Tato de Fano. Here's another quick provocation for actors and creatives. This is number five, Internal Landscape, which is more about the power of visualization to support your text. So first of all, here is the challenge. It's the classic old tongue twister, She Sells Seashells. I'll give you a moment to read it for yourself. You probably don't have any images in your mind other than the words on the page. So here are some images to back it up for you. This tongue twister is actually a story about the first female paleontologist and fossil collector, Mary Anning, and the important discoveries that she made in the fossil beds in the cliffs along the English Channel. In winter, landslides would expose new fossils and she'd have to collect them really quickly before they were lost to the sea. In fact, in 1833, one of these landslides sadly killed her little dog, Trey. Then Mary would go down onto the beach and she would sell these seashells, or actually fossils, to raise money for her next expeditions. Among Mary's discoveries were the first two plesiosaur skeletons that were ever found and identified. And what's more, it was Mary Anning who discovered that coprolites were actually fossilized dinosaur poo. She died in 1847, and here she is. If you look in the corner, you can see her little black and white dog, Trey, who sadly died in a landslide. Okay, now say the rhyme again, and I think you'll find that it feels so much easier to say when the words are supported by images and backstory. She sells seashells on the seashore. The shells she sells are seashells, I'm sure. No shed. See you next time.